Hey there, it's Mark. Let's check out these two Hot Wheels Monster Jam 6 packs. This one is called Crunch Force. It, was, it has a copyright of 2003. This one here is called Power Pack, and it has a copyright of 2005. I'm going to let these go on eBay. I'm going to focus on larger hub trucks. If you notice, these are larger. This one does have a uh, blemish in the corner right here. It does have a tear. You can tell it was from a collector. Look, they, they still have these inserts that keep this, try to keep this part flat. They never took them out, and I didn't either. It does have a rough corner, so it did appears to spend some time on the shelf, especially since you can see that corner right there. Still very displayable. Now, this one right here, this one's in great shape. Crunch Force, this is the older pack. Let's look at this one first. There are images of the trucks on the bottom front of the package. I don't know if these are, I know this one's a real truck, but like this one, Mine Blower, uh, I'm not sure. It looks like they made up that image because you can see like the graphics for speed right here. But this one does not, so that one's a real picture. This one's a real picture, so it looks like it probably is going to be a real truck. Sergeant Smash, Airborne, you want to see the logo? Okay, there's the logo. It has the, uh, what is it, NHRA, I forget, Hot Rod Association, Airborne Ranger, Holland Heat. Uh, once again, and look at the state stadium. Kind of looks like it's an artistic rendering. So I'm not sure it might not be a real truck. Well, let me tell you, I love that real truck, and I do have it loose, so I can let this package go because I already have that truck loose. And the last one it shows here, Snowhawk. Now, Snowhawk. I don't know if that's a real truck or not. The Hot Wheels Monster Jam truck, it might have been available only in this six truck set. Do you see this Sergeant Smash casting? It's kind of like uh, one of the Hummer models, or it's kind of based on that. In the back, it has, a, it has a spare tire in the back. Well, Snowhawk appears to be the same casting. I mean, it looks like it has lights above the uh, driver's compartment. And then you can see the, the bridge up above. You have that right there. So I think that's the same one. They just painted the windows to make it look different. Uh, I'm not sure. This truck might be exclusive to this set. And you know what? This set might actually have been only available in Canada. Uh, I'm not sure. Read the comments. There will be people more knowledgeable than I. I like to collect the toy trucks. I, I don't follow the series. I don't follow the events and, and, and the racing events. So uh, I couldn't tell you about the history of the trucks or anything like that. This one right here, this one is not American Guardian. This one is Airborne Ranger. Now some of these trucks were available in the singles. And if you follow my Mr. Groove's eBay account, you'll be seeing that I'll be listing lots of Monster Jam stuff, especially the small hubs and especially in the packages because I don't necessarily need them in the package. Uh, I'm fine with them being loose. Here's Mind Blower. And it looks like that, uh, mm, I forgot what the name of that truck was, Fire something. It looks like that body, I'm not sure. Mind blower. I think I have that one loose, so I can let it, let it go. And actually, if I don't have a loose, that's okay, because it's small hubs. And I prefer to have the large hub. This truck is nice. It's the, like, backdraft truck casting, which is like a paramedic. I believe it would be like a paramedic truck. So it looks like that's the casting that they used. Haul in heat. Really like this. And I do have this one loose. So I can let this six pack go. I'm not going to take a lot of time showing the back of the package and showing all of the trucks. It's just all the trucks that they release. Actually, uh, Snowhawk is right here. Uh, this one is pretty cool. The Monster Bus. Well, let's, let's keep moving. I said I wasn't going to spend too much time. Then I started talking about it. Here is the back of the newer set. And even though this set is large hubs, oh, I like that truck right there, Prime Evil. And I like the Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles. Uh, I like those for sure. I got Chill Out, Titus. Anything else my favorites over here? I'm not sure, let's go. This one again, it does have the cardboard insert. Like I said, it does have blemish right here, but that's all right. Let's take a look at the trucks. Here you have Power Forward. It's like a basketball theme. I'm trying to recall if that one actually was a real truck, some type of a promotional truck. By the way, this is, if you see blemishes on the plastic, 
it's mainly just uh, dust, even though I have been keeping them nicely in storage. Here you have full bore. I don't believe any of these are variations that were exclusive to this set. I don't believe so anyways. Here you have bad news travels fast. He has the kid on the bike. Let's go ahead and move that. Kind of hard to see the graphics. The gra graphics are very detailed on this truck. And it's hard to see when it's far away. Very nice. Here's Nightmare. Black with flames. When it moved like that, I was thinking, oh, don't tell me that's an error. Don't, Because sometimes the rivet isn't properly done. The riveting is not properly done. It's probably just moving around on the body. Bounty Hunter. Fairly popular truck. Chrome ribs. Black chassis. Oh, finally. Great. Thanks, Mark. Thanks for saving Grave Digger till last. You know, I'm a Grave Digger fan. Why'd you make me wait? Yeah, so, you know, you know, Grave Digger. Mattel and uh, even Spin Master, as far as that goes. They, they have to have the marquee truck in the mix more than anything else. <laughs> There's your Grave Digger in this set. So both of these sets are on eBay. The links will be in the description. And I usually put a pinned comment as well. They might have sold already. Sorry, that's the way it goes. And if you'd like to follow my Mr. Groove's eBay account, I'll be listing hundreds of Monster Jam trucks. I got a bunch. I'm not getting out. It's just I'm deciding what I'm going to keep and what I'm not. It would be great if these wound up in a viewer's collection. Thank you very much. Bye-bye.